Well, good morning. Just a few minutes before the top of the hour. Here's a look at the stories making news today. The rain we're seeing this week is not likely to put much of an impact in the drought conditions right now. Cross County is seeing severe and extreme droughts and the state saw its first exceptional drought since the U.S. Drought Monitor started in 2000. An agriculture outreach specialist with UW Madison says crops are being harvested earlier than normal and farmers are seeing crops dying off or having stunted growth. The former Sparta Masonic Temple building is turning 100 years old and to commemorate hitting the century mark, organizers are hosting a public program and tour. Admission is free and open to all. That program starts tonight at 7 with cake and refreshments to follow. This weekend, a special Apple Fest display fills the La Crescent History Center and Apple Museum. The museum will be open this Saturday from 10 until 4, where you can see firsthand how La Crescent's Apple history has changed. A lot of people looking forward to Apple Fest. In terms of today, Kyle, Vernon County Fair kicking off. So how are those conditions for opening day? It's a two thumbs up forecast for us. We got some more sunshine returning back into uh, the Cooley region. 70 degrees for our forecast high temperatures. Very similar feel to our two Tuesday and even from Monday, winds are out of the north at about 3 to 8 miles per hour. 45 degrees for tonight, mostly clear, chilly, winds out of the southeast, 0 to 5, and 78 degrees tomorrow. Sunny, warmer, winds out of the south now, 5 to 10 miles per hour, so those southerly winds helping us reach those upper 70s. So very seasonable, right near average by Thursday, slowly cooling on down into those mid-70s by Friday. We'll see some slight chances of showers and storms also returning along with those increasing clouds. Clouds. Could even see the occasional wind gusts reaching about 20 miles per hour. For Saturday, some more slight chances of showers and storms. High is going to be towards 73 degrees, so still dropping roughly 2 to 3 degrees by the day all the way into Sunday. Also seeing some sunshine. That's as we start the early to middle portions for next week.